Upon reflecting on my own practices as a healer and improviser, it becomes evident that most of what transpires in the course of improvising could be thought of as layers of manifestations, a series of occurrences within which, based in our willingness to be totally present, it becomes possible to realize that which resides in the state of potentiality. This is to say, that in essence, what gets projected are sonic representations of the worlds we dream of, similar to prayer, and in process, one becomes an essential contributor to the kinds of ecosystems responsible for our immediate realities. Just a thought.
just when I sat at the piano this morning, though I ended up not playing a single note, can my phrasing help me remember? Does it paint a picture of my people, their world and their history? How big or small a contribution each musical phrase brings to humanity? The piano responded in silence.
an interesting dream last night. I remember being asked, Why do you think human beings in this world are in such fear to create and share their creations? I responded, The people in this world are looking for perfection. The idea of perfection is an illusion as it is impossible for any individual to attain perfection. Perfection is the sum of all the imperfections. on the bandstand, came and leaned against the piano. I had not seen her since I was a baby when transitioned to the next dimension. In my thoughts I asked, where have you been Gogo? Did I just play something that resonated with you? Or have you been standing here all this time? And I just opened my eyes to you. Ilozi Elihle. And thank you for visiting. Oh, 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 mama, mama, Africa. Africa, Mama, 
After the rain, they were all dressed in white garments. They looked taller than any being I've seen in this realm. Their feet did not reach the ground. Somehow I knew their names. Although amongst themselves they spoke in a language I couldn't recognize, a more musical language than what we speak on this side. They surrounded me and they stretched their hands in the air and began chanting in very deep voices. I could also hear the drum from afar. They sang an ancient song the birds sang along to. It seemed as though the whole universe eventually remembered the song and for a moment every little thing could sing. Then another gigantic being appeared from the sky and sudden was gone. The music had stopped and I also had disappeared but continued to see. I continued to hear and then I woke up. <laughs> 